Warning, even with advanced airbags, children can be killed or seriously injured by the airbag. The back seat is the safest place for a child. Never put a rear-facing child seat in the front. Always use seat belts and child restraints. See owner's manual for more information about airbags. Fuck that. Hey guys, what's up? Dynamic here, and it's Friday. Fr no, it's not Dynamic. It is Wednesday. You are recording this on Wednesday, so don't sing about Friday. Gosh. G can't even get the days right. No wonder I'm failing. Or not. Or maybe I'm not failing. Yeah, I don't think I'm failing. Except, yeah. Maybe. I don't know. Figure it out. So anyway, guys, I'm bringing you a type gameplay. Type 95. With Red Dot on the map Hard Hat and Kill Confirmed. Kill Confirmed is probably the best game mode to level up in, in my opinion. I liked them, but then they put the spawn protection, which I think is stupid. I don't know if you think it's stupid, but I think it's stupid, and I think it's retarded, and I just think that they should just stop and just never do that. Never do spawn protection again. Ever. Just stop with the spawn protection. Fix it. And you know, you know what I don't like about COD Elite? I like COD Elite. It saves, saves a little bit of money. Get a few maps early. But here's what I don't get. Okay. <coughs> so, Xbox. On Tuesday, they got the entire map. All five, all f um, four maps and two Spec Ops missions came out <laughs> in a collection for non-elite members to buy. Now, PS3 Elite has only gotten the map Piazza and um, whatever that other map is. You've gotten those two. We haven't even gotten Overwatch yet. We haven't even gotten the second drop yet. And Xbox, non-elite Xbox members already have every single map and Spec Ops mode. And PS3 Elite doesn't even have the second drop. Please tell me how that works, Robert Bowling or anyone at Infinity Ward. Please tell me how that works for PS3 Elite members. Xbox has every, Xbox non-elite has every map. PS3 has one drop. I don't understand how that works at all. I really, what, is PS3 regular members going to have the entire drop the day, the, all the collections the day we get the second drop? Is that, is that how it's going to work? Are you going to give them that? So then it's like we just wasted money for when we were supposed to get something early? Like, I would understand maybe, like, I understand Xbox getting it before PS3, but then getting every single drop before we even get the second one and the non-elite members getting it, I think that's just retarded. I mean, come on, use some common sense here. I mean, it's like... <clears throat> First of all, they didn't when they first made Elite and called it out. They didn't say, "Oh, Xbox was gonna get it before PS3 Elite." They just said, "By buying Elite, you would get the maps first. Well, we are not getting the maps first. We are not getting them before regular Xbox. It says you would get them before regular players. We are not. Xbox regular has every map. We have the first drop. I just, I just think that's really like a bad call, and that's just stupid. I mean. That makes no sense. I don't even have Overwatch yet. I mean, come on. And they haven't even put them in. They haven't even put any of the maps in the regular playlist. You have to still go to the Elite playlist to play them. And if Xbox gets double XP this weekend, which they will for the map pack weekend, and PS3 doesn't get it, I'm going to be even more pissed. Because I need a Prestige. Again, I'm level 78. I'm going to Prestige today probably if I can... Get myself on there. Am I still... My FPS freaks still haven't arrived yet. My new elite FPS freaks. Oh, this is just such a bad day. Oh, my God. What the heck? Come on. I ordered them like two days ago. They should be here by now. Anyway, uh, the if anyone's wondering what the F... What's the difference between... Well, first of all, why I'm getting new FPS freaks. Uh, I'll show it in my vlog probably. I'll show my old ones because I'm going to be vlogging next weekend over spring break. And I'm going to be posting it like whenever I get back to the hotel room. So, Marriott, you better have fast internet. You understand me? You better be watching my commentary and you better have fast internet. You understand me, Marriott? That's right. Dynamic is coming to town, okay? Get the jingle bells ready and get the internet staff at work. Because my room needs high-powered internet. Alright? Okay. Glad we understand each other. I'm not ziplining over. I just got a text message. I'm not ziplining over alligators for nothing. That is right. You heard me right. We are ziplining over live alligators. <clears throat> live alligators! In Florida. And I just gotta. Stop texting me! Bad! But anyway, back to that. Yeah, so Florida vlogging is gonna be fun. 
But basically, my old FPS freaks, I got when Modern Warfare 2 came out. And so, yeah, I got them then. And they're kind of, like, worn out now. And they're just not that helpful anymore. So, I bought the new COD Elite ones. And the new Elite ones are basically, what they do is they're more for... They, they help your accuracy and help you control better because you can, like... You don't have to move it as much and it's not, like, uncon as much uncontrollable. And so, basically... It helps you with, like, assault rifles. They have, like, special ones for each gun, like sniper, submachine guns, shotguns, and assault rifles and LMG. I got the assault rifle ones because I'm more of an assault rifle guy, but I'm going to be getting the submachine gun ones eventually, too. And I'm going to be doing a before and after of my uh, setup. I'm going to do a before setup before I, like, start spending money on really good equipment and stuff like that. And start getting my other desk, my new desktop computer I'm going to save up for my, uh... You'll, you'll just see. You'll see my setup. I don't want to spoil it. Look how old this is. This is 5th Prestige. I'm about to be 7th Prestige by now. Gosh, such an old gameplay. I actually have a 97 kill gameplay, which I think is going to be pretty good gameplay with the MP7 UAV Care Package Predator. It's pretty low kill streaks to get a 96 kill game with. 96 or 97. Um, I don't have an Xbox. I've been having a lot of people messaging me about the Xbox <laughs> PS3 situation. And I do not have an Xbox. I'm sorry if you wanted me to play with you on Xbox. I don't have one. Uh, I'm not looking forward to getting one anytime soon. Like I said, I'm going to work on other things in my game setup. And I'm going to be doing an S&D series. So comment if you think that's a good idea. A Road to, a road to Gold, which would be a live series of me trying to get... like A live series of me using... Every time I use that gun... And until I get it gold. So comment what gun you guys want me to do. <clears throat> I'm also going to be, um, yeah, that's all I'm going to be doing. And, uh, yeah, the S&D tip series. Because S&D is the name of the game. And I'm the owner of the game. Because I paid $60 for it. So I'll do what I want. <clears throat> um, also, I just remembered a story from a while ago. Alright, so Immortals, or Bruce, I call him Bruce because he's my cousin, but if you don't know him, he'll be starting a commentary channel in May, so look forward to that, guys, you're all going to want to see that, trust me. He's going to be like the first person to get in a cyst-only mob, I bet you. I bet you, he's gotten, he's done that on Modern Warfare 2, he's gotten 48 assists in a game, it's, it's crazy, he's gotten 48 assists in a game, that's like insane, I think that's the record. Man, man, he's probably gonna try and get the riot shield gold, even though that's not even possible. He's gonna try and do it. He's gonna, he's gonna try and do it. He's gonna make some phone calls. Anyway, so Immortals <clears throat> was at a uh, Atlanta Brave ball game with my friend, and so for my friend, this is the worst day, one of the worst days ever. But for Bruce, it's a pretty good day. <clears throat> so it starts out like this: they're in the Atlanta Braves game. I don't know who they're playing. They're playing some team that won or lost. I don't even know. So they're playing this team. And basically, they hit a foul ball. It hits my friend in the face, bounces off his face, and then Bruce catches it. So Bruce gets a ball off my friend's face. Then everyone's feeling bad for the uh, my friend who got hit in the ball, the face with a ball. So then they went and they got free hats out of it and free food from the concession stand and like free jersey and stuff like that. Both of them. So Bruce got free jersey, free food, and he got a ball from the Atlanta Braves game. And he got to see someone get hit in the face with a baseball. And then he found uh, $5 in the trash can. So yeah, right there. $5 in the trash can. Seeing someone get hit in the face. Being in a Braves game. Free clothing and free food. At a Braves game. In Atlanta. Pretty good day to me. Seems Sounds like a pretty good day. I've been to an Atlanta Braves game before. And yeah. So, <clears throat> I don't know if you where you guys live. But here in Hilton Head, <clears throat> South Carolina... I no, I don't know where Wings lives, and I I'm in the same state as Wings of Redemption, but I never seen him. I wish I had. Think that'd be cool. The game's wrapping up, but anyway, there's a lot of Canadians playing golf, and because of Canadians, I can't play golf. So if you're Canadian, tell your friends to stop playing golf. Thank you. Thanks, guys. It's been dynamic. <clears throat> like me on Facebook. Follow me on Twitter. Links in the description. Pin me to, to your subscription tab, and like favorite this video and comment later, guys. It's been dynamic. Don't miss a video. Subscribe.